So I think when you think about digital disruption, again, because digital is so prevalent today, you get lost in the how and not the what. I think the what is customers now are, just want outcomes. You know, in other words, you used to sell a jet engine to United Airlines. Now what you're selling is power by the hour. You're, you're selling uptime guarantees. You're selling performance. Digital enables that, right? So, so don't think of it as kind of an end, end of itself. Think about it as a means to an end as it pertains to that relationship with the customer. So where does the risk get shared? What is the outcome guarantee? And that's what really drives uh, interface with, uh, or let's say that's the customer dividend from digitization. From a CEO standpoint, it's really, you have to enable a belief system, right? In, in other words, there's gonna be lots of people around you that are um, maybe more technical, or have more knowledge or know the customer and things like that. But in order to drive a real digital initiative, the CEO has to enable a belief system where data matters, where different kinds of talent are allowed to flourish, where metrics are changed, where you don't treat data like, like uh, it's a commodity, you treat it like it's a jewel. And that kind of starts at the top. So I think, I think the role of the CEO is to enable a belief system.